So I'm going to show you how to clean up a small spill uh, inside a fume hood. I have a, a small prop spillage material here, uh, which I'm just going to pour directly onto the fume hood floor. It's quite a small amount um, and it should be manageable by, by anybody really. And what we would normally use for these kind of spills is this kind of absorbent matting. They come perforated so you can just tear it to the size that you need. And that can be applied directly to the spill and then just allow that to soak in. All of this work must be carried out inside the fume mud and you can then just bag up any of the matting that you've used. Just make sure to wipe up any residue that's left over. You can then use acetone and tissue or another appropriate solvent. And then these tissues must go into the bag that you've already put aside. And we can also clean up uh, the reagent bottle that we've used. And then again, everything goes into the bag. And because I've been washing up, I'm gonna discard my gloves and they just go directly into the waste bag. And I'm just gonna change it into a fresh pair of gloves. Now, because this waste bag needs to be double bagged before it can be discarded into the waste. So you just need to squeeze out as much of the air as possible. This just reduces the possibility of puncturing while it's in the waste. And now that it's been double bagged, it can go into the standard waste bins. It's perfectly safe now and the outside is essentially free of any contamination because I've used second pair of gloves.